A long layoff in the middle of the season is not what the doctor ordered for this Quinnipiac men's basketball team. While all 10 other MAC teams have played at least one in-conference matchup, Quinnipiac has not played a game since December 6th and during that long layoff have had at least two known COVID outbreaks. But it's a new year and a fresh chance for this team to get a restart at a season at which they have started 2-2. Two and two. These are three New Year's resolutions that the Quinnipiac men's basketball team will be looking for in the 2021 calendar year. Resolution number one, get Brendan McGuire and Savion Lewis to average under two turnovers per game. Quinnipiac is first in the MAC in the number of turnovers that they commit per game and have traditionally been better at the second half of games. They have not committed less than 12 turnovers in the first half at all this season, and a big part of that is because Savion Lewis and Brendan McGuire, two younger guys on the team, are averaging over three turnovers per game. And they're the only guys that are averaging more than one and a half turnovers per game. Get Tyrese Williams back into the starting lineup. Williams has been sidelined since the Fairleigh Dickinson game for an unknown reason and for an indefinite amount of time. But the junior guard was supposed to be the main scorer on this team heading into the season. Now that has since been taken over by first year guard Ty Mushinery, who has excelled and is leading the team in points per game. But if you can get Tyrese Williams back, an experienced guard who has played with the likes of Rich Kelly, Kevin Marfo, and Aaron Falzone, he can really set a spark onto this offense, which has been one of the worst under Baker Dunleavy's tenure as the Quinnipiac head coach. Currently, this team is averaging under 64 points per game, which is on pace for the worst in program history. Resolution number three, go above 500 in MAC play. Losing your two best stars is not easy for any team at any level in any sport. And now throw into the fact that you haven't had a preseason, you've had a month long layoff in the middle of the season, and you are about to start your most important stretch of games. Now obviously this team last year with their two best stars went 500 in MAC play, but they weren't exactly set up for success heading into Atlantic City last year. This team was beat by the bottom of the MAC and they were throttled by the top of the MAC, but at their peak they played when they were playing their best basketball, they were beating and they could beat just about any opponent that they faced. Now this year's version of MAC basketball looks drastically different. And Quinnipiac is one of those teams that is surprising a lot of people with the likes of first year guard Time Machinery and Savion Lewis leading the team in points scored and assists. Now this team has a lot of ground to make up as they head into this next slate of games and if the team can go above 500 in MAC play, they will be set up for success moving forward. I'm Jack Main, Q30 Sports.